Brock Commons is an innovative mass timber hybrid building and student residence at the University of British Columbia. Brock Commons is currently the tallest contemporary hybrid mass timber building in the world. We have 11,000 beds on campus right now, largest in Canada, but despite that we have huge wait lists, uh, you know, in the neighbourhood of 7,000 students that would like to live on this campus if we had uh, capacity for it. Brock Commons is a hybrid design in that the primary superstructure, the vertical columns and the floor plates, they're all constructed with timber, whereas the uh, concrete cores, as we call them, the stair and elevator shafts, they're constructed with cast in place concrete. We used a hybrid design because different materials have different properties and some of them just uh, make sense to use. Uh, you get greater value out of them in different, um, uh, different locations and for different purposes. In Brock Commons, the uh, Gulam columns are all Douglas fir and the SPF, or spruce pine fir, that goes into the, the cross-laminated timber panels, that's provided by three companies in the province. We found that working with wood, we could reduce uh, timelines for construction. The assembly of the wood structure went up incredibly quickly, faster than we even expected. It took us nine and a half weeks to assemble an 18-story wood structure. We've shown in Brock Commons that the theory does work. They can be built and provide the level of safety that we expect in our buildings. As with any building, there's a multifaceted approach to fire protection. The primary approach in Brock Commons is the use of mass timber elements that inherently char and that provides wood with an inherent level of fire protection, in many ways superior to the fire protection you find on steel. In addition, the building obviously has full fire alarm systems, sprinkler systems, and the big feature was the addition of a water supply to the building so that the fire protection system would continue to work even if the city water supply was lost, such as might happen in an earthquake. From a seismic perspective, the uh, design of Rock Commons would meet all the requirements of the current building code. What makes it perhaps even a bit better here is uh, because it's a timber building, uh, it's also actually uh, lighter in weight, lighter in mass. So uh, with the concrete cores and with the light timber frame superstructure, it should perform uh, very well in an earthquake. Wood was used in the Brock Commons project because wood is a good building material. Fundamentally, that's why we used it. It's strong, it's sustainable, it's locally sourced. It supports the local economy in British Columbia. So it helps us meet the incredible increase in demand that we've had for on-campus accommodation at UBC. But it's also an example of sustainable and innovative design. And so really it helps us push forward in setting an example locally and to the world on what can be done with sustainable building materials.